What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, welcome. If you guys are already part of this wonderful family, you guys know the drill. Thank you guys so much for continuing to watch and to support. So in today's video, we are going to be doing our first boxy charm of the year, base box unboxing. Okay, so here we do have our base box. This does retail for $27.99. They actually recently just raised their prices. They used to be $25 a month for the base box, and now it is now, I believe, $27.99. You still get your five full-size beauty products inside the box, and I believe they retail up to like $175. So in my opinion, it's still a pretty good deal. So this month's theme is refresh, which I absolutely love. It's the new year. We all needed a fresh start. We needed to refresh our bodies, minds, and souls, and so start off the new year and hopefully this year brings the best for everybody so that is the theme I love it so this right here is the card beautiful flowers nice feeling refreshed and like I said ready for a new year the back of course has all of the details for all of the products along with the prices and a brief description of what the product is and what it does and all of that good stuff so let's go ahead and dive in to some of these products these are my bare brows I actually got them microbladed I'm coming up to almost a year uh, since I did my microblading so I am almost due for an annual touch-up so um, they're kind of like fading a little bit in the front now which is totally normal I mean it's been a year I wash my face twice every single day morning and night so of course they're gonna fade that's why you have to go for your, like your annual touch-ups to kind of maintain them so I am coming up for that very soon but boxycharm got me because they did send over some brow products and let me tell you guys both of these brow products the first thing that they sent is this Anastasia Beverly Hills brush in 7B. You guys may be very familiar with these brushes. These were like the it brushes back when like pomades were popping back in like, I don't even remember, like 2017, 2018. If you guys remember that, those were the days. But it is a dual sided brush, so it does have a spoolie on one end and then you have oh I'm throwing things here so this is what the brush looks like you do have your spoolie on one end and then the angled brush on the other now I remember this brush was very very precise I loved to just kind of like really thin it out when it had pomade and just really get in here and create very light strokes so we're gonna be going for like that pomade brow look that we used to love back then I actually love them now the brow microblading that I got done was actually powder brows which kind of mimics that like pomade Instagram brow look so I absolutely love that brow look so this brush actually came in a set so the other thing that they sent was I didn't I thought it was like two separate things but I guess this counts as like one if I'm not mistaken this counts as one item it comes as a set and for both of these together it is $39 so this next thing that they sent was the Anastasia dip brow pomade you guys remember this I'm sure everybody here knows what the dip brow prom dip brow pomade is and I'm sure you have seen it before so this is the packaging right here they did send me the shade caramel which actually is going to match me perfectly I had a little bit of a um, hair situation happen so my hair is really light right now and yeah all of my old brow products are not gonna fit my new hair so it's a long story but long story short do not do your hair at home that's all I have to say and I just remember this being like the it product back in like 2018 this is the shade caramel which is lighter than the share the shade that I used to buy which I think will match my um, my brows a lot better so I'm gonna start off by just kind of combing out the brows and making sure they're good and ready to go so this right here is the pomade that I'm gonna be using today I'm very excited I haven't used a pomade in I don't know how long I remember this being just so creamy and so pigmented I mean, look at how like precise that is. It is such a like defined brush. So like mid brow, I'm gonna just kind of take that and outline the top. What I've been loving is I like a very defined brow towards the end and then the front, I like it a little bit more fluffy. Looking good, I love this pomade. I forgot how much I really loved this pomade. So I do feel like this was a very good match. It wasn't too deep for my um, for my hair right now, so I like it. It matches my roots 
matches my roots very well. I know it's like very bright up here, but underneath there we still have our, some of our roots. So, okay, so I went ahead and I cleaned up my brows a little bit. This is what the finished product of the brow pomade looks like. Together, these two retail for $39, and I love that I got it for my box this month. All right, so the next thing that we got in our box is actually an eyeshadow palette. I love when I get eyeshadow palettes. This is actually an eyeshadow palette that I already received in a previous box. This is from Real Her, and this is the Dreams So Big eyeshadow palette. This does retail for $28. And I believe from what I remember, it is a nine pan palette. Yes. So this is what the palette looks like. It is very beautiful as far as the colors in here. You have a little bit of your shimmers. You have some of your mattes. Very beautiful shades and it's a totally wearable palette. So that's what we're going to be using for today's eye look. My lids are actually already prepped and primed and ready to go. So let's go ahead and just dive right into this. So I'm going to start off with this shade right here, which is Imagine. So what I've been loving lately is a matte shadow all over the lid and just popping that inner corner with a bright highlight. I have been loving that look. So that's what I'm going to be going for today. I'm going to just do matte all over and then we're going to pop that inner corner with some highlight. For that highlight, I am going to be using this dream shade right here, which is a very bright white um, shade. I'm going to be taking some of this Desire shade and possibly mixing it with this one, which is Envision. I'm going to take both of those and just start kind of blending them towards the lid. So I'm going to just kind of go back and forth between the two and apply that all over the lid. This doesn't have to be precise. It's just kind of like a more of a blending technique. I don't know if you guys can see, but it is very powdery. There's a lot of powder and a lot of fallout in the palette. So I definitely recommend if you're going to be using this palette to definitely use it before you do your face makeup because there's going to be powder everywhere. So now taking this deep shade, which is Empower down here, I'm going to go ahead and deepen out those outer corners. This is a slightly shimmer shade, but it's deep enough to kind of deepen out this outer corner. So with a tiny little brush like this one, this is from the e.l.f. Mint Melt Collection. I'm going to go in with this Dream Shade, which is this very bright white shimmer shade. And I'm going to use that to highlight underneath the brow a little bit. Oh, it's coming off like yellow almost. Okay, I was not expecting it to go all over the place. And then I also want to use this shade to really pop the inner corner. All right, so this is what the finished eye look looks like. That was using my uh, Real Her Dream So Big eyeshadow palette that we got inside the box. Like I said, this does retail for $28. My recommendations is definitely to do it. If you're going to be using this palette, definitely use it before you apply your face makeup because it's a lot of fallout and kind of powdery. But the end result is always a very, very pretty. Like you saw, it's definitely a very beautiful palette to use like on an everyday basis. Moving along in the box, we actually have this mask mascara from Pure Cosmetics. This retails for $22. This is the fully charged mascara powered by magnetic technology. It has the little bunny logo so it is cruelty free. Of course we love that and it is in the shade black. Oh okay so this is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Okay so we are going to try this on camera. I went ahead and just gave my lashes a quick little curl but let's go ahead and see how this starts applying. Okay, so I can see my lashes growing, I guess you can say. All right, so can you guys see a difference? I definitely feel like it separated and lengthened my lashes for sure. Yeah, I can definitely see the length and the separation of the lashes, so very nice. I'm going to be throwing falsies on top of this anyways, so we're just going to do a quick coat. I definitely feel like my lashes look longer and they feel a little bit separated so I really like that. I would love to see a little bit more volume but I do like the mascara and I think that I could totally see myself using this like on days when I'm just wearing mascara and not any uh, falsies. I'm going to try to blend this part out because I did get some of the uh, mascara on my shadow. So I'm going to go ahead and jump off of camera really quick, throw on some more of my makeup, and then come back for the rest of the items in my box. So far, 
I'm digging the box. All right, so we are back. I went ahead and I applied my foundation. I went ahead and threw on my lashes and I also applied some bronzer. So the next product in my January BoxyCharm box, we got a blush. I always see this blush and this shade literally everywhere. It seems to be everybody's favorite. So this is from NARS and this is the Orgasm Blush. So this is what the packaging looks like. This does retail for $30 and like I mentioned, I have never used this, but I see it every Everywhere. I literally always constantly hear the NARS orgasm blush is one of the best blushes out there da 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 so thank you boxycharm I am now going to jump on this bandwagon and try it out so this is the blush right here and this is it is a cult favorite and it is their best selling blush it delivers a weightless natural looking rush of cheek color in matte satin and shimmering finishes Ooh, I like the packaging on this. Very cute. I love this print. NARS. Very cute. I actually don't think I've ever tried anything from their brand. <gasps> this is pretty. Okay, so this is the shade, and I feel like it would look very pretty with this eyeshadow look. It is so cute, and it also, it's so cute. Like, it's a little compact mirror. How cute is that? And we're going to just start applying that. Ooh, that's very pretty. It's a very soft, subtle flush of color onto the cheeks. I feel like this shade goes perfect with this eye look and it delivers like a nice shimmer to the cheek. Like if you look at it, it looks like I applied a very small amount of highlight onto the face. It's very cute. All right, so moving on to the last and final product in my BoxyCharm for this month. This is from Dragon Beauty, and it says this is the Lip Job Liner and Sharpener. So this is the packaging right here. It is really big, but this does retail for $18. Now this says that you're supposed to contour, reshape, and create your ultimate lip fantasy with this extra long lip pencil, ultra moisturizing and hydrating. This formula serves fuller lips and needle free so this is the packaging right here and i don't know if it has like the lip liner and the sharpener in here or if it's like an all-in-one i don't know but it does say it is in the shade 2.0 cc so i think that's like in reference as like lip fillers i don't know i i'm not familiar with that kind of stuff but let's see oh okay so it has the lip liner and then it has the little sharpener right here this is a cute little sharpener and actually i was in need of a new sharpener i had like three and ask me where any single one of them is i have no idea i can't find them but this is the lip pencil it is actually very big like compared to regular lip pencils so this is one from jacqueline cosmetics i mean you can see the difference in height it is very big so i'm curious to see what this is all about i actually i'm really loving the shade of this lip pencil it's like the perfect nude like absolutely perfect let me actually swatch it out right here for you guys look at that that is like the perfect nude for my skin tone i think for any skin tone this would look really pretty but let's keep applying i don't even know what to say so i am actually really in love with this lip color it looks very very pretty so i'm gonna actually top it off with some lip gloss so i'm gonna apply this like all over the lip as like a base color but i'm really really liking this lip color and i'm gonna top it off with my mint melt lip plumping gloss this one is from elf and this is the mint chocolate shade so i'm gonna go ahead and apply this one I think this shade goes perfect with this lip liner. Okay, I'm really liking this lip combo. All right, so this is the final look with all of the products from this month's BoxyCharm. I went ahead and I actually totaled up the entire box and all of my items was a total of $137. So again, they did bump up their prices. So I did pay $27.99 for this month's box. Of course, that includes shipping and I did get my five full size items. You guys saw everything that I applied on today's look and I actually really like it. I love some of these products that I was actually very surprised with, like this lip liner, for example. I was absolutely like shocked with this lip liner. I really liked the way that this looked. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know if you guys got any of these same products. Let me know what you guys thought about the final look and turn on your post notifications on for those future uploads and I will see you guys in my next video. Ciao.